Hello, Bram Grote Films here to tell you about my uh, video plans for 2020. First, I'll start out with some exciting news that should reduce my video frequency to even more than what it is already. So, uh, here is an image from the end of my Wind in the Willows adaptation. Take note of those two mice, which are specifically field mice. And more specifically, they're based on myself and... Well, at the time, she was my girlfriend, but now she's my fiancé. Yep, I'm getting married this summer. At the end of July. The exact date is none of your business. But because of that, I'm officially releasing myself from the obligation to, to have a video uploaded every single month. I might still try if I feel up to it, but I'm no longer going to make myself feel obligated to do it that frequently. And also, probably the whole chaos of Kappa will probably have an influence. Although I'm not entirely sure at that point, I might have to see what actually happens with that. I apologize if you want me to go into more details about Kappa. Honestly, I'm not quite feeling up to talking about it. But anyway, on to the uh, video projects themselves that I hope to make. First up, I want to make a video celebrating the 10th anniversary of the Six Vanishing Engines. This project to me seems popular enough that I feel like I should do something to celebrate the 10th anniversary. I'm really hoping to make a whole behind-the-scenes video about it, explaining the origins of the idea in detail and the like. I actually did make something like that, or at least I tried to, back when I first released the film, but I didn't... I, I can't remember exactly how much I made of this before deciding it wasn't worth it, because I wasn't sure if it was going to be popular enough. Well, I believe it has, since there are actually people who grew up with the film that are... Uh, that were kids when it first came out, but now they've grown up since then. That's something I plan to cover in the documentary. I might even make something for the American Invasion, since, uh, since parts 3 through 6 celebrate their 5th anniversary this year. But I'll have to see if that idea is popular enough. And then, uh, the other thing I'm also hoping to make is, uh, I'm ho also hoping to adapt the, the missing coach a couple of times. One way I want to adapt it is in HO skill form with Bachman models, adapting both Hello Twins and The Missing Coach in ways that are true to the original stories, except I want to include a beginning and an end that ties it in with the present day series. Well, roughly present day. The other way I want to adapt it is adapt it in the way that I imagine that the television series would have adapted. So I'm adapting it in a four and a half minute form, and as this screenshot indicates, I plan to do this particular adaptation in trains form. I had considered doing it in HO scale form as well, but I decided that would be too complicated, mainly because to do a truly television series accurate thing I'd have to turn the Tidmouth set around, and I feel like that would be too complicated, especially since I'm trying to reduce my workload with uh, the marriage and all. And also, another HO skill idea I have is perhaps redoing my Nat Food Station uh, train spotting video that I made a few years ago. But I tried that once before and I couldn't find the time for it, but still I'd love to do it because I feel like it could really use an update. And also for clay animation, basically I'm just doing a few loose ends from past projects that I've made. Things that I wasn't satisfied with the amount of detail that I adapted them in before, so I'm adapting them more fully now. And so to sum up, I'm getting married and that will affect how many videos I make, but uh, I'm hoping by the end of the summer to make a video celebrating the 10th anniversary of the Six Vanishing Engines, perhaps a video celebrating the 5th anniversary of the American Invasion, uh, an HO scale adaptation of Hello Twins and the Missing Coach, a Trains adaptation of The Missing Coach television series style, tying up loose ends with my clay animation works of The Hobbit and The Wind and the Willows, and then and possibly making a Bachman Thomas uh, train spotting video. And that sums it up. Thank you for watching.